In November 2002, development of a new Star Wars game began at Pandemic Studios, with its goal to create the ultimate fan's dream and allowed team strategy and would feature battles and worlds from every one of the six Star Wars films. On January 13, 2004, LucasArts announced Star Wars Battlefront as a multiplayer action game. It brings battles between four main factions from both the original and prequel trilogies. The Galactic Republic, the Confederacy of Independent Systems, the Rebel Alliance and the Evil Galactic Empire. In each faction, five different classes of characters are available. Four main classes are similar for each faction. Infantry, Heavy Weapons, Pilot and Sniper. While the fifth is unique. Each faction also has a non-playable hero character that participates in battle for a limited amount of time. Depending on the faction of choice, Count Dooku, Mace Windu, Luke Skywalker or Darth Vader can join the fight. Gameplay in Battlefront is conquest based. Each faction has an infinite amount of reinforcements and each is given control of a set number of command posts in a given level. The object is to either eliminate enemy forces or capture and hold all command posts simultaneously for 20 seconds. We captured a command post. Enemy forces have captured a command post. Players cannot only fight as an infantry trooper, but have access to several ground and air vehicles. These range from the hulking AT-AT to the fast speeder bike and vary based on the level. With more than 25 different vehicles to use, some of them also function as mobile command posts, which cannot be captured, but is lost if the vehicle is destroyed. We've lost the command post. While the game is played similarly in every mode, each features a unique scenario which utilizes mode-specific features to further extend gameplay. Three modes are presented to the player. Campaign, which serves as the game's story mode, Galactic Conquest, and instant action. Enemy forces have captured a command post. Campaign groups several battles together in a set order loosely based on the historical campaign of either the Clone Wars or the Galactic Civil War. Since Revenge of the Sith was still a year away, the Clone Wars campaign ends with the Battle of Kashyyyk. The player starts the campaign as either a member of the Separatist Army or an Imperial Stormtrooper. Around halfway through the chosen campaign, the perspective switches to the clone troopers or rebels so player can experience the war from both sides. In Galactic Conquest, the player uses strategy to take control of planets and dominate an area of the galaxy. At the beginning, the player chooses a map configuration based on conflicts from both eras of Star Wars history. Some maps start both sides evenly, while others favor one faction. Next, the player chooses which faction to play as. The game is played in turns, with the player starting first. The player can select an enemy controlled or neutral planet to attack. If one side manages to win 4 battles, they gain access to their faction's secret base bonus. Secret base bonuses are very powerful and can change the course of a game. Galactic Conquest ends when one faction controls all planets on the map. Instant action allows the player to jump right into a battle of their choice. The player can customize a list of battles, which then can be played through in any order, on any map, with any faction. Players can also choose whether or not they would like to have heroes fight for each side. The Microsoft Windows and Macintosh versions of Star Wars Battlefront can be played online with up to 64 players via local area network or over the internet. The Xbox version can bring up to 32 players together, while the PlayStation 2 version only supports 16 players. Star Wars Battlefront released on September 21, 2004, the same day as the Star Wars Trilogy DVD set. 
owners of the set with an Xbox could use the DVD to play an exclusive demo of the game. And that's just the beginning. Fans who want to live the Star Wars adventure can experience an Xbox playable demo of the new LucasArts video game, Star Wars Battlefront, where you can be on the front lines of every classic Star Wars battle. It is useless to resist. Battlefront became a big hit, spawning an entire series of video games. That series is popular to this day. 